We're standing on one of these famous J70s. They're about seven meters long. That's where the name comes from. They're 225 large. And we've got the project manager, Joachim Helmich, with us. Joachim, tell us something about the boat. They're pretty quick, aren't they, when you have wind? Yeah, they are, they are uh, pretty quick uh, in relation to the size of the boats. Uh, but the, the major thing is uh, they are quite easy to sail, which means uh, um, you don't, do not need to be very, very experienced with a boat to be competitive. Finally, you need to train, to train hard to win a regatta, but that is one of the major facts uh, that this boat is so successful. It's fast, it's easy to sail, uh, it's a very nice boat, very modern uh, design, so we love it uh, for league sailing. But it's finally not the only answer. There are some, some other boats available in, in the world, uh, but J70 is one of the really good shots. It's one of the boats that's been... We've got 12 nations here, so they all sail the, uh, the J70. So they all know the boat. Is that very important for the whole idea of the Champions League, that they all have the same conditions and they all sail on the same boats? Uh, f finally, it's not. So, but uh, most of the nations, as you already said, uh, have drawn the decision to work with uh, this type of boat. Um, there are some, some races uh, during very, very uh, tall and big countries like Russia. They are sailing on several boats during the season because you can't take the boats from uh, the very east of uh, Russia to the very west of Russia uh, in, a, in a short time. So they are dealing with, uh, with other boats also. So the, uh, it, it's, it's not the, the class which defines the league. It's the league that's defining the event and the, the format. Uh, and J70, again, is, uh, is a perfect answer to do it. Can the J70 sail perfectly on lakes, here in shores and on the open water? Is it good for that? In any kind of conditions. So we have seen uh, races in Germany with uh, waves of two meters and 25 knots of wind in Travemünde uh, three years ago. It was amazing uh, how, how good these boats behave in really heavy conditions. Uh, we, we never had serious problems, um, just by some little, little aspects, but um, really good. Thank you very much, Yoki. Let's see how quick these boats come into surfing.